Hello, Miss Mom Staff and Students. This is Mr. Lon with your Monday A Day announcements. Hope everyone had a wonderful weekend. Every time I have to do these announcements after a weekend, I feel rusty. Here I go. Here I go again. From Nurse Chris, attention, 11th and 12th grade students, prom will be here before you know it. Deposits for prom will be accepted until March the 17th. If you are interested in attending prom, you need to pay a $50 holler. The final balance is due May 1st. That is, by the way, just a deposit, students. The $50 holler, just a deposit. See Miss Chris, Miss Bacon, or Mr. Trainer with any questions. Upcoming events today, we have the 10th grade Roller skating party, more on that in just a bit. This Wednesday and Thursday, shout out to Nurse Chris. We have the Eagles iMobile this Friday. Busy week. We have the 90% or better attendance dance. And then this is a really big one. We need all seniors in attendance. On Monday the 13th, we have a senior class meeting where we're going to talk about a lot of different things. A lot of different things, seniors. NACTI, prom, graduation, Act 158, graduation requirements, et cetera. And students, as you know, our number one priority at MassBomb always is educators to keep you safe and healthy so that you can learn. That means reach out to a staff member that you trust if you have concerns or problems because we are here to support you. All right. Remember, the 10th grade school trip is today. It's to Rolling Thunder. All right, the cost is $10. The time is from 10 to 1. You must turn in your permission slips to your CTE teacher. Look, if you haven't done it already, you better make this happen fast. And you can look on, well, number six doesn't even matter at this point. All right, class trip today, 10th grade. Let's go. I want to thank Coach Calamag for getting things rolling with Women's History Month 2023. I was talking to Coach the other day. She has a great concept for this year. The National Women's Alliance, History Alliance, which spearheaded the movement for March, being declared National Women's History Month, has announced the women's history theme for 2023, celebrating women who tell our stories. All right, I like it. Throughout 2023, the association, or the alliance rather, will encourage recognition of women past and present who have been active in all forms of media and storytelling, including print, radio, TV, stage, screen, blogs, podcasts, and more. The timely theme honors women in every community who have devoted their lives and talents to producing art, pursuing truth, and reflecting the human condition decade after decade. Again, want to thank Coach Calamag for getting us started, and I know Coach has some really cool things coming up for us for this theme in Women's History Month. Reminder about our 90% attendance initiative. March's theme is March Madness because students, it is madness when you attend school every day. Madness in the most positive sense of the term madness. That means no more than two absences. We will be having a school-wide games day in the 122 gym. For students who have 90% or better attendance for the month of March, when is that games day going to be? Oh, yes, it will be April 13th from 1 to 2.30. Also, you know, we don't just have the games day, but there's an additional surprise and entrance into the raffle to win one of five $100 gift cards just for having 9% or better attendance. There's going to be $500 gift cards Turned out, that's significant. Yes, it is. I would like to get a $100 gift card. My attendance is going to be great. But I'm not going to be raffle eligible. But it's going to be good nevertheless. So make sure, students, you attend school for the month of March to be eligible to attend for game day. And also, students, go to all of your classes on time with fidelity. Reminder for Coach Cal Magauer, athletic director again, that spring sports begins today, March the 6th, and free physicals are available at citylifehealth.com backslash locations backslash again. All right. If you need a little more guidance on that, go find 
Coach Calamag in room 308. In the way of clubs today, we have the Spanish Media and Translation Club with Mr. King today, meeting in room 605 after school. We have the Tabletop Games Club with Mr. Thomas in room 407. Hey, Mr. Thomas, do you think we can get a new slide for this? I mean, I can use this slide, but this is like from September. So Mr. Thomas, or if a student in Mr. Thomas's class wants to do a new slide, let's get at it. Gamers Club of Mr. Lamumba meets today. This slide also from September, but it doesn't date itself on the actual slide. Rubik's Cube Club with Miss Walker. Daily before school, 7 to 7.30. Reminder about the free mental health and well-being service. Kuth bracelet sales for our ninth grade ambassadors. Chromebook repairs. Social media. Students. It's that time of year, 2023. March Mammal Madness! If you're learning, you're winning, <coughs> grab a bracket and earn PBIS points. See Ms. McLaughlin in room 306 for more info in a bracket and or join the 2023 March Mammal Madness Google Classroom with code Z-H-A-P-T-P-W. All right. Get... Your picks lined up. The season is upon us. 2023 marks the 10th anniversary of this annual event. This year, those who participate will earn PBIS points as they earn points on their bracket. The more you play, there's a mammal in the background, my beagle making herself known for God knows what reason. Um, you can get PBIS points. My dog, Joy, is not getting PBIS points right now. I will say that much. Students in my classes, this is Ms. McLaughlin, can also earn a little side action extra credit. Terms and conditions will apply. See Ms. McLaughlin on 306 for more info and a bracket or join the 2023 Google Classroom again right there. All students are eligible to participate. Thank you, Ms. McLaughlin, for spearheading this great, great, Annual event. Staff and student shout outs. Mr. Lon, that's me! Would like to shout out Dronica Outlaw for starting work on the Culture Fest 2023 logo. It's going to be a competition. It will. More info on that, but Dronica wanted to get a head start. So shout out to Dronica. Miss Walker would like to shout out the mystery student who donated beads for the ninth grade ambassador bracelet fundraiser. Thank you so much. I would like to thank the staff and students who have purchased bracelets. Your support has helped us raise enough money to help Covenant House Pennsylvania provide personal hygiene products, linens, and PPE for homeless in Philadelphia. And for Mr. Thomas, Wayne Toole, the incredible checkmate in Mr. Thomas, Wednesday, March 1st, in the early hours of the morning. Hey, mystery student. Hey, Wayne Toole. Hey, Veronica Outlaw, great job. And also great job by Miss Walker. Great job by Mr. Thomas. And you know what, Mr. Lon, even by you, great job coming off the top rope today with that shout out. All of us, all of us. National Day, National Days. Today is National Dentist Day, all right? Also, National Oreo Cookie Day. Did you know that Oreo cookies are dairy-free and vegan? Like, I'm not making that up. That doesn't feel like it should fit into my understanding of reality, but that is a true statement. Oreo cookies are, daily, are dairy-free and vegan. Now, that cream filling, it's not dairy. I don't know what it is. It's something, but it's vegan. It's vegan. Hey, Mass Bomb, we build the future. Have a great, great Monday.